Hey guys, welcome back to today's episode where I'm going to show you how you can best edit your photos using Canva. I'm going to use two methods that you'll be able to uh, get your photo enhanced uh, in the best possible way. If you're new here, my name is Steve and my goal is to help you learn something new, something new each week that you'll be able to help improve yourself and even make some extra income if that's what you are looking for without disturbing your day job. So if you're ready, let's get into it. The first thing for you to do is obviously to create an account. Uh, so you go to canva.com and create a free account there. You can also create a trial account or a pro account where you will have 30 days to trial Canva of all its, uh, uh, the whole interface in general, really, with that 30 days. So I encourage you to trial 30 day with a pro account and you'll be amazed at what you get from it. Disclaimer, some of the things that I'm going to show you today will require you to have a pro account. Now that you've created an account, the first thing that you're going to do is go to home page of Canva and on the home page, you can go to file and then go to create a new account or create a design rather. And then you create which um, design you want. You've got all different uh, formats there. So I'll go to uh, Facebook post landscape, which I have on the screen here. Uh, so you can create that as well. So once you are there, then you can go to elements there and click on elements. And on elements that you can type the photos uh, if you don't have a photo um, already. Or you can just go down to uploads. If you've got a photo in your computer, you just click on uploads and then upload that photo into your uh, into your your uh, your canvas and that's what I've done but I, I'll I'll use elements as well to show you you can go to elements and then type photos there and then um, um, get different photos that you want if you are creating something but if it's your own photo obviously you go to download so I'm going to use uh, um, elements because I've got a photo that I've already created that I've already uploaded there it's this one so then you go into your photo you click on it and it comes onto the canvas and on the canvas make sure that you uh, right click on the photo and then you go to set images background or you can just use the three dots there and then scroll down and you get to set images background and that's where you're going to work uh, so then next step is to click on the photo or on that canvas and then go to edit there will be a menu at the top there uh, go to edit and then on the left uh, toolbar you'll see different options there what you're going to use is the magic studio and on the magic studio you're going to use magic eraser and uh, magic grab these are the two options that canva has and it's just incredible how they work really so let's try the grab first the magic uh, grab so you click on that and then it will highlight all the options that you can obviously grab from the photo. So we're going to use the click and then we're just going to go and click onto that one and then it highlights that and then we come onto the menu, click on grab and then it does its magic. Quickly it will just take that out, you grab that off so quickly. Depending on your um, speed of your internet this will be quicker, uh, less than a minute and then you'll be done so let's wait and see and there you go you've got the result now let's see what is grabbed so i'll just move that see so it grabbed that uh person there uh then there you go then you just delete there and then your photo i'll just um, zoom in so we can see see the photo is uh, all clear and there's nothing left there and that's how you can do that and then i'll just go back so we can try the second method let's use the same photo so i'll go back and then bring that person there and that's it so the second method i'm going to click on the uh, photo again like we did before then you go to edit and then instead of using the grab you're going to use the magic eraser so we just click onto that and then the magic eraser gives us the brush and then the brush uh, it's got size there so now it's on 20 you can increase the size of the brush then you can take out uh, most of it so most of the the item that you want to take off the uh, the photo so i'm going to use this because i want to remove the same person so i'll just uh, zoom in a little bit zoom out a little bit and then i think uh, 12 should be fine yeah and then there's uh highlight that and then once you've highlighted what you want you can do it a few times uh, then you go to erase and then it will work the magic and depending on the the color strength of the photo whether it's dark or light sometimes you might have to do it a couple of times to get the, the best result 
So hopefully this one should be good and we'll just have to do it once. Let's see. And there you go, the result is out and let's see, let's zoom out again just to, to see if you can tell. You might have to do it a little bit there again, let's bring the brush down a, a little and then and then color that and then we erase and then it should now be back to normal. Let's see. Yeah, I think uh, it will be good. Yeah, so just depending on the type of photo, that the colors in the photo, sometimes you might need to redo it uh, a couple of times to get the best results. Okay, let's see. And there you go. As you guys can see, it's nothing there. It looks really nice now, as I've done it a couple of times. So there you go. And these are the two methods that you can best edit your photo in Canva. If you've been wondering whether you can do it without Photoshop, so you can do it really, really well with Canva, but you need that account to be a pro account. So as I said, you can go and get a pro account. You just log into canva.com and then do a 30 day trial to see what you like about it. If you've enjoyed this guys, let me know in the comments and let us know how you you enjoyed it or how you found it whether it was easy for you or you had some problems otherwise please don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and then we'll see you in the next one you take care and once again happy new year this is the last video of the year and i hope you guys have a wonderful wonderful new year and welcome it really well <laughs> okay you take care and i'll talk to you soon bye